What's going on guys and welcome back to another Overwatch live commentary today. We're jumping in playing as Ana Amari, everyone's favorite new support hero. We got our Wasteland skin, we got our tea time taunt, the two essential cosmetics you absolutely gotta have when jumping in and playing this hero. We've got a Widowmaker who in the previous round was kind of not very good so I am a little bit worried about our ability to, you know, not lose this but I guess we'll see. Either way, I got high hopes. I don't actually have high hopes, but I've got faith that, you know, maybe we might perform a miracle and not lose the game. And let's see if we can keep our team healed up, because right now, this enemy is running in really aggressively. And I'm also kind of worried about the uh, Genji that I just saw run behind. And I know he's going to come and bite me in the butt in a few seconds here. But I also made the mistake of buying myself a highlight intro for uh, Ana Amari, which is a really, really, really big mistake. Because, well... Anyone who's played Overwatch recently and seen Ana in your games, you'd know that she quite literally never, and I mean never, gets play of the game. I'm really worried there's a bad guy. Oh, I was going to say, I saw you there. We got to go. We got to go. We got to go! I'm not ready to die. What the? I got that. There we go. I'm out of here. Holy crap, we killed her. I don't know what just happened, but I'm very scared. Keep him alive. Come on, Widow. Play a hero that isn't bad. What are we doing here? I gotta wait for our tank to come through, then I'm gonna boost him up. Where is he? Roadhog's gonna come back through the teleport any second now. Oh no! They blew up our teleport! See, Tracer, you just, you can't sneak up on a girl like that. It's very, very rude. There you go. That's the burst damage combo that you've got for Ana, which is really, really useful. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can get this off on the Roadhog. If we don't, uh, if we don't give him the boost right now, I think we might have lost this. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Get in there, baby! Oh my god, that is such, like, a beautiful ultimate combo. Here we go. Man, we're actually playing pretty well right now. I feel like we should also have a couple more eliminations, but... I guess that's kind of what Ana is. She doesn't necessarily tend to do insanely well at anything. She's kind of a bit of an all-rounder. She'll get medium heals, medium damage, medium eliminations, medium everything. Which I like, because it means that she's always ridiculously active. You're always either healing people, or attacking people, or running in, doing damage. It's a good all-round feeling, and I really don't want to die. No! Not me! Why me?! Am I the only one that feels like whenever a Genji ultimates, he literally singles me out? Every single time. I am the one who dies. It's like being the one who knocks, just less cool. Let's see if we can get this far. Come on, one, one more shot. She's so hurt. Get him. Oh my god, he's dead. Thank you, team. No, this is mine. I heal you. You people leave this to me. Everyone's so hurt. I got you, babe. Let's get back in there. I don't know who I can use this ulti on. Let's go. Let's try using it on him. There you go. Dead I am, baby. Oh my god, the triple kill. That was actually totally good. I wasn't sure whether using that on McCree was a, a bad idea or a good idea, but looks like it worked pretty well. Okay, here we go. McCree's back up. Keeping this team alive is a real full-time job. And even then, like, I don't think having one Ana on your team is ever really enough in terms of, like, supports, supporting heals. Like, right there, you can see they're just taking so much damage. Ana is kind of like a medium healer. She's like a Zenyatta. She's not really enough to have by herself. She's really, really strong, just not alone. Okay, let's see if we can just scare that McCree off the cart. Good job, dude. You got this. Oh, no. There we go. I got you back, baby. Get in there, Roadhog. Oh, he might have his ulti soon, I think. And then I've got mine. Roadhog, when you ulti, I'll boost you. The number one thing I've found about Ana is she gets her ulti really, really regularly. Trace is dead. Oh, come on. Keep him up. There we go. Okay. Is he going to go in soon? Go, 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 go! Oh, my God. Thank God. Yeah, get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Nice. Oh, I love that you actually, like, feel the damage numbers when your uh, boosted target goes in. It makes you kind of, like, feel like you're doing a lot more than you, than, I get, than you really are, I guess. Holy Jesus, okay. Let's just heal that up right there. Get our Roadhog back up to full health. One of the interesting changes they made in this patch is now self-healing 
goes towards charging ultimate. So Roadhog actually healing himself is kind of an important part of him getting his ultimate. And oh god. Of course I'm the one that they kill. I'm just a poor innocent support hero. Oh no, my team's getting wiped. They're getting wiped. They're getting wiped. See what I mean? As soon as I leave the fight, everything goes wrong. Just because we've only got me for heals. Junkrat, if you drop back into the alley, I can heal you. There's a Reaper coming. There we go. Good job. This is one of the really awesome things about Ana. Just being able to sit back from so far away and try to keep your team healed up. Please drop back. Kobe! Can we get the Kobe heal? No, I missed. Oh my god, they're all so hurt. I can't heal you! The I'm sorry, dude. The Roadhog was blocking the heals. Oh boy, this is not good. Stop moving! I can't hit people! Okay, here we go. Sometimes I feel like my team is better at dodging me than they are at dodging the enemy. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, Jesus. Heal this dude up. Go, 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 go. Has he got his ulti? Oh, he does! Boost! Go, baby! Yes! Oh, that was destruction. There you go. Okay, minute 17 on the clock. I am actually going to drop back a bit here. Go to sleep. See, sometimes, even if you don't kill someone from putting them to sleep, it's just good to do it anyway, because you effectively knock them out of the fight for six seconds, which can be really, really useful. Okay, I am kind of... Jesus Christ, he just got rolled. Don't run in there, Symmetra. There's like the entire team. 50 seconds left. Oh, I couldn't get him up in time. I don't know what to do here. Stay alive, Roadhog. Stay alive, baby. Do it for me. I reckon they're going to cap this right here. Oh, I want to get up into the side room. I kind of want to be out of the line of sight, but still close enough that I can throw my grenades. And they capped it. Okay, we should go. We should really, really go. I got you, babe. Symmetra, don't keep moving, please. Okay. Keeping her alive for now. Why did those things always hit me? I wonder if he's almost got ulti again. What's your charge, Roadhog? No! I don't even know why I did that. That was dumb. That was a waste. He didn't kill anyone. I should have saved that. Okay, let's see if I can get the heals on the team. Good job, Roadhog. You did it. Actually, maybe that wasn't so bad after all. I thought that was a really bad call, but it kind of worked out. Let's see if we can just keep healing these people up. I want to get a few more sleep darts. Oh, they've switched to an Ana. Oh, no. Oh, damn it. I'm trying to shoot the bad guys. My team's always getting in the way. Come on. Show yourself. There you go. It's like you've permanently got Widowmaker's ult, but for your own team. That's a really weird way to look at it, actually. Okay. I'm just amazed how quickly we get our ult up. I feel like I've used it about four or five times already this game. If you just keep holding down M1, constantly healing and damaging and supporting your team... It's amazing how quickly you can build it up. And that's the good thing about Ana, is that she pretty much always is either damaging or... I want to see if I can heal our Widow. Hey, there we go. The Kobe. Okay, 60 seconds left. We can do this. Get in there, Roadhog. Oh, wait. I'm 80. Oh, if I can get like one or two more shots. One or two more shots. Okay, there we go. We got my ulti. What's your charge, Roadhog? I'm going to have to go for the Kobe and Widow again. Oh, I missed! Okay, I'm going to drop back up here. With a bit more height, I should be able to reach her. There we go. Come forward, Widow. Widow, walk forward. No, okay. She doesn't want heals. Whatever. This is actually working kind of well. I'm surprised. Oh, no. Not the ulti, Reinhardt. That's always really, really scary. Okay, I'm going to save him. There you go. Coming back with the counter ulti. Keeping the team alive. Oh my god, that is beautiful. Okay. Oh, it's so hard to keep this going. We are putting out so many heals right now, and we did it! That was such an intense game, and I actually feel like we played well. 
The thing you notice about Arno is she doesn't actually end up with that many medals, but it doesn't necessarily mean you didn't do pretty well. And I feel like we did actually help our team out a lot there. Yes, and we get the honor boosted ulti as the play of the game. Here we go. One, two, three. See, the cool thing is, when he's got that damage boost, he doesn't even need to get a full lock on to get the kill. Because with the extra damage, you don't need it. But, as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you, Legends, in the next one. Bye-bye.